still standing on my ten toes. I still care. Counted an unfortunate encounter with EFCC last year. He described how EFCC personnel forcibly entered his residence without a warrant, disrupting his peace. I can speak for myself, honestly, because I, I can't speak for other people, you know, and what they're going through. Well, for me, I can speak for myself because I know that I did nothing wrong, you know. I just woke up one day. The only thing that I just think is really scary about what, it, what they're doing is the fact that you can just break into anybody's house and with no remorse, no no compensation, you know, they broke into my house and they lied, <laughs> you know, that they were doing some routine check. Uh, I don't know if there's anything called routine check because how can you come to somebody's house that is an artist? And the crazy thing is, I'm going to say this because most of them were Hausa and they were speaking Hausa. And the crazy thing is they didn't know how to speak Hausa. So in, their, in Hausa, they were saying that, oh, they told us that this house, we shouldn't have come here. <laughs> like, so, so I didn't say anything till when they were leaving, I spoke Hausa back and I could see that they were ashamed of themselves. So um, the only thing I'm going to say about EFCC is it's just it's, it's sad that some people that have given power to reform and help make this country a better place are using it to bully younger boys or young young kids that is, you know, I mean, I'm not going to say it's everybody that, has, that is make, doing it like that is making their money honestly. So, but I can speak for myself because I'm sure there are other people like me that are bullied by these same people for no reason. But I'm glad that, you know, as soon as that happened, I think they changed the EFCC, the person that was in charge of the EFCC and these reforms and all that nonsense has stopped. And um, we can only just hope for the best because, I mean, this government, you know, at least they're trying. You know? <laughs>